Alrighty, welcome back. I am the Executioner, and uh, today's video, oh my god, I'm recording this at fucking 4 a.m. in the morning. Sorry. Um, but, yeah, I want to address the Dapperton controversy. Now, I was going to stay neutral in this case, but I sided with Filthy and Esso because they are my friends. They have helped me out through various social situations, be it anxiety, depression, etc. And a lot of her friends that are on their side have helped me with that as well. So I can't really... Um, I, I really owe it to them in that sense. Now, addressing Dapperson's claim that I am nothing without him in that uh, I was, he made me. Now, look, I've been at this since the 1st of December 2016. And the fact is, yeah, I didn't have a lot of subs. Now, when I changed my avatar, I came into contact with Dapperton and he recommended Fertile. And I gotta thank him for that one. I gotta thank him for featuring me on Libertoons. That was a really fantastic experience. Uh, now, on the other hand, I don't really like... I don't really like how he claims I'm nothing without him when those are only a few instances where he has promoted me. Um, not really a few, but a couple. Um, now, the people who have really featured me on all their other channels is Filthy, Esso, uh, Postal Cat, a whole bunch of people have featured me on that. So, I really gotta thank them more. Now, the thing is, those are the people who gained me subscribers, not Dapperton. Dapperton, I'd say he gained me, like, at least 15 subs. But, uh, SO and Filthy, they've gained me a huge bulk of my subscribers outside of me doing hard work and actually posting to my channel. Now, to Dapperton's claim that I... I, I just really don't like this situation going on. If they propose a truce or something those free, then whatever. I'll stay out of the conflict. Uh, I'll withdraw from it. But if there isn't a truce, I'll still voice my goddamn opinion. Now, I wasn't going to, um, usually I keep things very private here, but I really, there is conversation with Mr. Dapperton that I really have to go over. Now, I recommended, I, I said making fun of his video about the whole fade to dust situation, I commented that, oh, it's the shittiest quality, you know, joking around here. Not really, but uh, saying you have a white background, etc. He then messages me on Twitter, and I'll have it on screen right now, that um, he goes, I'll read the comments to be, uh, I'll read it. I could remove the white background. I was thinking too, but I thought it wouldn't look like a comic if I did. But I'll remove the white background and test it to see if it has that comic feel. Sends me the test video. I can do it, I just don't want to. Um, in regards to, I think it was my comments in the... I, I think it was one of my comments. Uh, I said, wait, why are you talking to me? Like it's just business as usual. You know, I'm just saying that because it's kind of weird somebody who does not like me would comment, uh, would uh, tweet that towards me, DM-wise. He goes, oh, I can't just talk to you anymore? LOL. Forget it. Fade to dust. Oh, wait. You were nothing to be, uh, you were never anything to begin with. Actually, I was something because I actually existed on YouTube, so that fails from a logical point of view, and I have 160 subs, so that isn't huge, but it's definitely a little bit of something, Dapperton. Now, I responded back with, no, I am just asking why you're talking to me like it's business as usual, and I also ask, since you act like I'm your enemy, why would you input, uh, why would you take my input on a video you made of you making fun of us? Uh, yeah, you know, it's, and when I made that comment, he deleted the video right afterwards, so if he's very that insecure about his videos, etc., why would he even acknowledge my comment, you know? But, um, now I don't, I, I never really share these DMs, because I think privacy is good, but that's really something that has to be brought to the forefront here, because... Just, I really think Dapperton's gone way over his head here, and that he really needs to take a look back and say, think, hey, uh, me making an ass of myself is drawing way much attention to myself, and people are going to leave at one point. And 
uh, that 120 subs, 120,000 subs will turn into 119,000, then it'll go slowly down from there because they'll be tired of hearing all this drama. Uh, subs, some subs can be very loyal, but some just want to hear fucking videos, and you getting involved with drama isn't going to gain you any subs from that. It's only going to do the opposite. So, it, you're not really doing any favors here to yourself. So, yeah, I just want to get that out of the way here. Um, if Daps really wants to come to the table with SO, Filthy, or even chat with me, that's alright and solve this issue. But, um, him taking offense to everything and acting like a fucking prima donna is not going to solve anything. So, yeah, I'm just addressing that whole controversy on the issue. You might have saw my back and forth with the, um, with his subs and people he works with. Um, yeah, y you've seen that. And to be honest here, I don't really care about that. I just care about this fucking drama ending because this is just absolute bullshit. Um, if Daps wants to talk to me about ending it, whatever, but, um, I probably will have an open mind to it, but I'm not really changing if I, if he keeps up this arrogance with either Esso or Filthy. So, yeah. Uh, guys, I hope you liked the video. If you really, really like the video, uh, please subscribe, share, um, just do whatever, you know, sub, <laughs> share the channel around. Uh, if you really like my videos, please consider donating to my Patreon or Bitcoin. All links are in the description. Love you guys, have an awesome week, and have an awesome 4th of July if you are kind of into that sort of thing. Uh, I'm anarchist, so I'm not really, but um, any people out there that's doing the 4th of July, uh, do that, be safe, just be safe in general. So, uh, Love you guys. Bye.